What's up, everyone? Welcome back. All right. So the Rangers still lead 6-1 to one over the Dodgers. So, yeah, we'll see how this shit progresses. That being said, I'm going to go take a fucking piss real quick, so I'll be back in just a minute or two or three. Yosemite Grandal will lead it off here in the top of inning number seven. The catcher, number nine, Yosemite Grandal. Some action out in the bullpen. Couple of right-handers starting to loosen up. Now the first pitch. Fouled back. Here's the pitch. That's in there. And he's deep in the hole now, 0-2. Well, the guy you see right there calling the shots has opted to roll with his starter here to begin his half of the seventh. And that pitch count is a concern, so he may get the chance to finish this inning off and then call it a night. Pitch by Darvish is on the ground for Andrus at short. Throwing the dirt, but a good job of staying with it that time as he's retired. Nicely done there at short as you see him ranging to his left. He takes it on his forehand side and then flips it to first for the out. Here's J. Roll, Jimmy Rollins now. Batting left-handed here as he takes a look at strike one. I know we have a tendency in the media to get hung up on pitch counts, but this is a legitimate workload he's sweated through so far. Yeah, anytime you get up around that 110 mark, you put in a full shift, and he's fast approaching it here. And now the Ranger bullpen swings into action. A lefty and a right-hander are throwing down there. Here's Darvish on 0 and 2. And this pitch is lined into center field, and he's going to reach with his second hit of the night. With some guys, it doesn't matter if it's 0 and 2 or 2 and 0. They take the same approach either way. Well, this right here is one of those guys, and he comes through from being down in the count. Here's Carl Crawford now, as he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. A look here at the hits per side here in the late going. He's set, now the pitch. Hit pretty well as this is out toward deep center. Under it is Martin, and that's out number two. That ball was hit well, and it might have been a different story if he pulled it. Instead, he hit it to the big part of the ballpark, and he's retired. Yasiel Puig will stand in, and they've been able to hold him in check so far, over three to this point. Yeah, it's kind of surprising that he's been a non-factor in this one, usually a major force in their offense. First offering on the way. Down and away, one ball and no strike. And even though on the mound he's had his way with him, this is a dangerous customer, so don't get to thinking you're bulletproof out there. And with Adrian Gonzalez just around the corner, we'll see a lefty getting loose in the bullpen now. 1-0. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. And you wonder if he's feeling just a little bit distracted having that base dealer over there at first base. Sometimes just the... All right, I am back. ...mess with your head out there. Maybe trouble now. Here's the 2-0. and Fouled straight back. Now the 2-1 pitch. And this is on the ground, but foul. Wide of Beltre over at third.
2-2 pitch on the way. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. And even though that runs the count full, you'll at least get the benefit of giving that runner at first a head start here. Here's the payoff pitch. And this is fouled at the plate. pitch one more time and a good at bat that time as he lays off for ball four and as a result that'll move a runner up into scoring position now with two away wow just a great at bat right there simple as that patient laid off some tough pitches he was rewarded Adrian Gonzalez will get his shot now with two on and two out here in inning number seven a couple of righties starting to loosen now in the bullpen First pitch coming. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. Bullpen working behind him, but you know this guy does not want to give up the baseball. And he never does. I just don't think that's in his mentality. 1-0 on the way. Now a swing from Adrian, and this is on the ground after second. On the first, and the Dodgers All right, so that'll end the inning. Still 6-1. to one. The Rangers lead the Dodgers. J.P. Howell will get the ball now as he'll take over on the mound to start the home seventh. J.P. Howell. Prince Fielder will stand in again the first will flash you back to the very first inning of the ballgame. Exactly be the smoothest way to enter a ball game. He's lucky that one didn't get him. One-zero on the way. Sinker stays outside and it's behind now. Two and zero. Well, you've got the matchup you wanted, but that's not going to amount to much if you can't throw strikes. the 2-0 and a sinker is over that time it's back to two and one figure we'll probably see a heavy dose of that sinker here tonight it's really a pitch you'll lean on especially when he needs that ground ball but even in situations like this where he's just trying to get ahead here's the 2-1 pitch sinker and that's ruled strike two the 2-2 pitch. Swing and a ball line hard towards short. And he set down one away. Yeah, good effort there. And that ball is but it's all over that shit. Nice little spin move there. Nice solid throw. He's able to get him out. Adrian Belfry as he'll swing at the first pitch and send one on the ground to first and a sliding attempt at first but this sneaks by him a base hit Mitch Moreland get another shot he hit into a double play his last time Here's the first pitch. Swing and a ball hit well to the right side, but this will get into the crowd. From the belt, the pitch. 
And here's a ball hit in the air. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Foss now the pitch. Hit hard back up the middle. And Rollins won't get there. It's a base hit. Well, he got that first out easy enough when he came on. But now it's back-to-back -back hits here with one away. So he's going to have to bear down now and make sure that this thing doesn't get any worse. Jake Smolinski will step in now. 0 for 2 to this point. Now the first pitch. Now a 58-foot curveball that misses for a ball. Now, how important is it going to be for this guy to throw that curveball for strikes? I don't know that he necessarily needs to ever throw it for a strike. I mean, if it's around the plate and he's getting guys to go after it, it's doing its job. But if he starts to get too high or too far outside, then it's just an easy take. First and second now, one man out. The 2-0. And this one's over at the knees, 2-1. and one. Now the 2-1. Curveball and a dandy right there. And from 2-0, and oh, it's back to 2-2 two and two now. Boy, he just turned that thing over perfectly. He put that thing right on a dime. Runners are at first and second with one away. Here's the 2-2 two and two offering. Breaking ball. Called third strike as that catches the zone for route number two. And when you're trying Dude's to got some nice facial hair. Not really sure why I waited till just now to mention that, but yeah, <laughs> not really much else to discuss. I mean, again, it's fucking baseball, you know. Not really, not really a whole lot of uh, shit to talk about. In my humble opinion, baseball is not a particularly action-packed sport. <laughs> At least compared to other sports anyway. Getting a little deeper now, it's 2 and 0. And now at the plate with a 2 and 0 count, it's not just hey, this has to be a strike. You've got to look for one pitch in one location and then let it rip. He set now the pitch. Down low and the plot thickens here, 3 and 0. A 2 out hit here would be nice, but a 2 out walk wouldn't be the worst thing in the world either. pitch and there's a strike as he'll try to work his way back it's three and one yeah he needed that one to avoid loading the bases but it's still a long road back from here Let's go, guys. now the three one and the good fastball there finds the zone as the count goes full now three and two Hard to believe he let that one go. He, that was right on a platter for him. From the belt, kicks and deals. And he'll just fight this one off as it's chopped foul. Another full count pitch home. And he stays alive as this is grounded foul. Another payoff pitch. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. Got him. And the Rangers squander a good opportunity here as the side is retired. Rangers leave a pair. They lead it six to one. All right, peace out.